Greetings, this is Earthman, Origami's Living Soil, servant of the Most High God, servant of the God who is alive and well. And he loves us, and he has provided the most perfect ecosystem that we could ever imagine. And all we have to do is look into his creation and mimic it. And that's what I hope to do and hope to teach you guys. And I learn from you guys too, likewise. And um, what do we have here? Well, in this plastic bag, I have <clears throat> my indigenous microbe organism chamber. Um, a whole bunch of different type of soils and different things like that. I bet you guys are getting sick of this here. But I am, oh, I am, oh. But it's really important to have indigenous microbes and other type of microbes that are beneficial for your soil. Like I said, I put other microbes that are in there. We're going to do another video in a week or two here about a nitrate fixer that I, uh, I use. Um, and so let's uh, unveil the cover. All right, and a uh, whole lot of action going on here. Whoa, look at that. More fur. Um, the one on the left is, uh, I've already had brown sugar to it, and this is what it looked like before. Um, it's cooked rice, and I put them both in there about a week ago. And, um, and you know, jeez, uh, I covered it up, and look at that. My soil, <clears throat> my soil is loaded with uh, just hyphies, lots of delicious looking uh, bacteria and fungi going on there. And um, so, uh, like I said before, what you do is you get your uh, IMO chamber, a uh, mixture of different soils, uh, maybe some worm casting, some Alaskan hummus, some leaf mold, uh, collect from different areas where the ground is spongy and white, has some white, you know, white mycelin in it, or um, it's just nice rich earth, and throw that in there, and just a whole bunch of different um, soil sources, and sources where, you know, that have beneficial bacteria, and then you take your cooked rice, put it in a smaller container, put it in there for about a week and a half, week, and then uh, when the, you know, white um, mycelin, the starts forming on the top, you're good to go, and you mix equal amounts of brown sugar with the rice that you put in there, and that's your IMO. It looks uh, delicious, doesn't it? Uh, maybe not to us, but to plants, it's Wonder Bar. And so, um, you know, when I'm going to do that, that'll last for a while, and I can mix that with, uh, make a little tea, a little uh, IMO 2 tea, and... Um, uh, you know, and I and I mix that with wheat bran with a little additional molasses to it, and I get myself some IMO3, and you can just do some amazing things with IMO3. So I'm going to end this video. Just a quick one for you. Uh, you know, I know I've done IMO videos before, but I had all this beautiful growth I wanted to show you guys, and it was just, you know, what a beauty. Um, that is soil... Uh, magic right there and uh, no, no magic about it it's it's uh, God's creation at its best and uh, I always encourage you living soil is where you need to look to and uh, just stay away from all that miracle grow crap and all that other junk oh, I didn't mean to say crap but uh, it is junk but um, uh, may God bless you your family and I hope that you guys are doing well and if you like the videos keep uh, you know subscribe to them uh, I've got a lot more different uh, bacteria type and fungi bacteria uh, videos coming out uh, in the near future. May God bless you.